Hi, this is Laura Tucker with Really Entertainment News. Vivica A. Fox says Donald Trump is a jerk, but he's not a racist. Really? Celebrity Apprentice fans remember her as a contestant on the show. She had her problems on that show too, if I remember correctly, getting along with people. But she says that Donald has turned into an absolute jerk and that she's not mincing words. However, she found him to be an absolute gentleman while she was on the show. But now she's not appreciating his negativity and believes, as I do, that he's brought reality TV into politics. Her opinion on him has changed because of his comments about women. She also wishes he wouldn't insult other nationalities. Yet, she still doesn't think he's a racist. I don't get that. Apparently, the impending divorce between Amber Heard and Johnny Depp is still contentious. Police were called to their home on Monday. Really? Her lawyer called the cops after people connected with Johnny Depp came to take some of his things. An officer reports that this was not a violation of her restraining order against him and neither one of them were in the home at the time. The police were only there to ensure that only items listed in the court order were removed. How bad does it have to be to have to have a court order to only take certain things from your own home? Yeah, I know, it probably happens a lot, but that just blows my mind. Then we have Patrick Swayze's widow. She actually had to defend herself against accusations she was abusive to him during their marriage. Really? That was published in Radar Online. They said she would beat on, on him and he would beat on the walls and furniture when they were fighting. And after he got sick, she would claw at his arms and neck and punch and slap him. Come on, really? I don't know why she even dignified that story with a response, but her spokesperson said it was categorically untrue. Charlie Sheen has announced he's never getting married again. Really? Do I hear a collective whew from women all over the world? Is there a line forming for aging HIV inflicted actors who say they don't have enough money to support their children? He says he has his hands full dealing with his health and isn't even dating right now. And he would sooner walk on the moon than head back to the altar acknowledging that he's terrible at it and that he's 0 and 3. Well, it's good he recognizes that but I think at least his last two wives would like to send him to the moon. <laughs>